uh, let's see, I wanted to tell you about teachers. When you first connect with a teacher, you need a lot of very, very intense work. At the very beginning, you need a lot of very intense work and a lot of guidance. After a while, when you've got a bite on it a little bit, you've got hold of the thing a little bit, the teacher can let you go and you can do something and come back and then the teacher will look at you and say, all right, or we'll see what your work and say, well, you could have kind of got, I think this is not a good, you should go that direction maybe. And then it goes fewer and fewer and fewer contacts until uh, in the case of, uh, of, of all esoteric sciences, you're in the best total contact you can be, in which case you don't need the physical contact at all. It's not necessary. So that that's the, the process. So it starts out with extremely bunched up, very, very compressed contact, and then it gets less and less as, it, as you go down the line, unless you happen to be in the bodhisattva vow. Now what that means is that you've decided that you're not going to take liberation. You're instead going to go back on the wheel voluntarily in order to bail those people out whose asses are still in trouble. So that's about it. Uh, then in that case it's intensity all the way through and uh, there's no let up and there's no there's no Ease, there's no easing of the way, no easing of the path. When you take that path, there's never a place to rest your head, is how it says. Never a place to rest your head. There's nowhere to rest. There's nothing you can do except just keep plowing on, jamming on. It's like running the flag in TF2.